Hi, Camp Blodgett. This is Lucy Dyer Joswick, the executive director, and my daughter. What's your name? Gina. We are going to be doing a video for you today on how to make salt dough clay. So you have to make salt dough. We're gonna hold up what your ingredients are so you can get them together. You need to have one cup salt, two cups flour, and one cup of warm water. Do you want it on the back too? We have this all inside of a bowl, our salt and our flour. Yep. And now Juna is going to add our warm water, the ingredient that will activate our dough. Now what you're gonna do is stir this all together to get a dough-like consistency. And then the most fun part is to knead it. So we'll turn the video back on when we're getting to knead our dough. Okay, now we are gonna show you how we are kneading the dough. Of course, you wanna have your hands washed all the time nowadays, but especially here. And you wanna get your surface, for us it's our counter, covered in flour so that your dough doesn't stick to it. So we're gonna turn around and She's very kissy today. Hope your kids are too. And show them the dough. We need a dough. All right, to knead your dough, basically you wanna cover your surface with flour like Juna did, and then put the dough down on the counter. And what are you doing with it, Juna? I'm smushing it down. Yep, so you kinda of wanna smush yeah. it down, knead it together with your fingers. I'm gonna put on hand in. We already will put your hand in later and we'll show you the next step in just a moment. All right, now that you have kneaded your dough, you can start to create the objects of your desire. Uh, Juna and I today are gonna create a handprint. Uh, I'm pretty sure none of us are going to forget our coronavirus captivity time, but this is one way that your family can create a time capsule of what size their hands were uh, and uh, kind of put this memory into stone, so to speak. So I'm gonna turn this around and show you our little dough and then Juna's going to put her hand in it to show you how to sink her fingers into the dough. You wanna make sure that you press firmly so that you can actually get a handprint in there. There you go. You're gonna put that onto your cookie sheet with all the rest of your beautiful objects. And go ahead. Once you have had your child put their hand inside of your dough, then you're gonna put that in the oven at 325, 350 degrees, and really bake it until it is hard as a rock. You don't wanna get it too brown because that means it's burnt. And uh, product, folks. So you can see that Juna filled it in with glue and then sprinkled two different types of glitter and she painted around it. Um, so the before and then our after right here. Hopefully you had fun with our salt clay dough. Thank you so much for watching.